Good evening and uh, welcome to today's press conference of the EHF <laughs> qualification match between the Füchse Berlin and Chambéry Savoie. Halftime score was 14-14 and the final score was 24-22. Uh, to my right is coach uh, Ivica Obrovan of Chambéry Savoie and his player Damir Bicanic. Welcome. And to my left there is the coach of the Füchse Berlin, Elingo Richardson and Kevin Struck. Uh, Mr. Orvan, uh, what was your impression of the game today? Uh, problem with the translation. I will translate. Ah, okay. Vaše vidjenje utakmice. First, he wants to congratulate to the team of Berlin uh, for a win in both matches. Igrali smo protiv trenutno prvaka klubskog svijeta. We played against uh, club uh, world champion. Uh, we played two very interesting uh, matches and uh, nevertheless they won uh, both. Uh, we had some chances, uh, especially in the first match. And uh, to do something more, uh, today uh, we had to play better in the first match. Uh, he wants to congratulate uh, uh, to Berlin and uh, to wish them to, to win uh, this EHF uh, Cup. Thank you. And Ellingham, uh, how would you evaluate the game today? Yeah, uh, enough of English. I think yeah. Uh, thank you for the congrats and thank you for two interesting game. Uh, we did play like before, good defense most of the time. Uh, in in attack, we did too many uh, pass failure. I think I think we had 17 pass uh, failure gemacht, or uh, we did make uh, 17 failures. And that, of course, is too much. But at least I'm uh, happy about that we we did qualify, and we did win Champery two times, and we knew that they they have a very strong team with very good players with very good coach. So of course, uh, that's for I'm I'm really happy that we are had qualified. Thank you, Mr. Bichanish. At the end, there were two close games. And uh, what would you have done better in order to qualify for the next round? Um, for sure, uh, better uh, first match because we we played the uh, I think worst match since the last two years. We were so bad and we made a lot of mistakes. Uh, uh, we had uh, great defense first uh, half, but second half was uh, not so good and. Uh, Attack was, uh, I don't know, worst in last five seasons. I'm talking about first match. But we came here uh, uh, to win because we know that we have a good team and we, we gave everything tonight. Uh, unfortunately, we lost. And uh, last 15 minutes, uh, we made some uh, risk shots and uh, risk uh, passes because we had the minus three. But uh, they didn't work, and I want to congratulate to the Berlin because they played uh, very good two matches and they won fair and square. Kevin, um, last year you did not qualify against Chambéry. Uh, how excited are you now to be in the next round? Um, we are very excited to be in the next round. Um, last year this was uh, there were two very hard games, and this this year too. And yeah, we are. Uh, this is very rough the games, and we are happy that we are, uh, are in the next round now. Okay, your questions, please. We can even translate them in English. You can ask in German if you want. Yeah. Sorry, uh, once more, uh, once again in the microphone, please. Which role played the goalkeeper of the Berlin team in both games? Oh. Uh, Heinefetter uh, was uh, great, uh, especially tonight. Uh, he was unbelievable. Uh, I don't know how many saves he had tonight, but uh, I think he was a key player, man of the match. So, if you are man of the match, then you are 
your best <laughs> tonight. So I think uh, he was, because if you lose uh, minus three and uh, you have goalkeeper that had uh, 20 saves, what you can say any more about him. So. All right. Thank you for coming then, and uh, we wish our guest team a safe journey back home to the French Alps. And uh, before we end the press conference, next draw for the third qualification round will be at the 18th of October. And for the German people and German journalists in this room, um, our next Bundesliga match will be on the 23rd of October at 3 p.m. against HC Erlangen. Thank you.